Equistum is the only living genus in Equisitaceae, a family of vascular plants that reproduce by spores rather than seeds. Equistum is a living fossil as it is the only living genus of the entire class Equistopsida, which for over 100 million years was much more diverse and dominated the industry of late Paleozoic forests. Some Equistopsida were large trees reaching to 30 meters tall. The genus Calamites of the family Calamitaceae, for example, is abundant in coal deposits from the Carboniferous period. A superficially similar but entirely unrelated flowering plant genus, mare's tail, is occasionally referred to as horsetail, and adding to confusion, the name mare's tail is sometimes applied to equistum. It has been suggested that the pattern of spacing of nodes in horsetails, wherein those toward the apex of the shoot are increasingly close together, inspired John Napier to discover logarithms. Etymology, the name horsetail, often used for the entire group, arose because the branched species somewhat resemble a horse's tail. Similarly, the scientific name equistum derives from the Latin equus plus ceta. Other names include candoc for branching individuals, and snake grass or scouring rush for unbranched or sparsely branched individuals. The latter name refers to the rush-like appearance of the plants, and to the fact that the stems are coated with abrasive silicates, making them useful for scouring metal items such as cooking pots or drinking mugs, particularly those made of tin. In German, the corresponding name is Zinkraut. Rough horsetail yemel is still boiled and then dried in Japan, to be used for the final polishing process on woodcraft to produce a smoother finish than any sandpaper. Description in these plants the leaves are greatly reduced and usually non-photosynthetic. They contain a single, non-branching vascular trace, which is the defining feature of microfills. However, it has recently been recognized that horsetail microfills are probably not ancestral as in Lycopodiophyta, but rather derived adaptations, evolved by reduction of megafills. They are, therefore, sometimes referred to as megafills to reflect this homology. The leaves of horsetails are arranged in whorls fused into nodal sheaths. The stems are green and photosynthetic, and are distinctive in being hollow, jointed and ridged. There may or may not be whorls of branches at the nodes. Equals spores equals, the spores are born under sporangiophores in strobili, cone-like structures at the tips of some of the stems. In many species the cone-bearing shoots are unbranched, and in some they are non-photosynthetic produced early in spring separately from photosynthetic, sterile shoots. In some other species they are very similar to sterile shoots, photosynthetic and with whorls of branches. Horsetails are mostly homosporous, though in the field horsetail smaller spores give rise to male prothalli. The spores have four elators that act as moisture-sensitive springs, assisting spore dispersal after the sporangia have split open longitudinally equals equistum cell walls equals, the crude cell extracts of all equistum species tested contain mixed linkage glucan, xyloglucan endotransglucosylase activity. This is a novel enzyme and is not known to occur in any other plants. In addition, the cell walls of all equistum species tested contain mixed linkage glucan, a polysaccharide which, until recently, was thought to be confined to the poles. The evolutionary distance between equistum and the poles suggests that each evolved MLG independently. The presence of MXE activity in equistum suggests that they have evolved MLG along with some mechanism of cell wall modification. The lack of MXE in the poles suggests that there it must play some other, currently unknown, role. Due to the correlation between MXE activity and cell age, MXE has been proposed to promote the cessation of cell expansion. Taxonomy. Equal species equals, the living members of the genus Equistum are divided into two distinct lineages, which are usually treated as subgenera. Hybrids are common, but hybridization has only been recorded between members of the same subgenus. Subgenus Equistum, Equistum arvancel a euro field horsetail, common horsetail or mare's tail, Equistum bogotins can't the euro andean horsetail. Equistum diffusum L A Euro Himalayan horsetail, Equistum fluviatal L A Euro water horsetail, Equistum palister L A Euro marsh horsetail, Equistum pretensi H R H.
a Euro Meadow Horsetail, Shave Horsetail, Shady Horsetail, Equistum Silver Tycom LA Euro Wood Horsetail, Equistum Tel Mature EHRH, a Euro Great Horsetail, Northern Giant Horsetail, Subchnus High Watch Arnett, Equistum Gigantium LA Euro Southern Giant Horsetail or Giant Horsetail, Equistum Mario Catum SCHLTDL, and Cham. A Euro Mexican Giant Horsetail, Equistum Yim LLA Euro Rough Horsetail, Scouring Brush Horsetail, Equistum Lavagatum May Brawn A Euro Smooth Horsetail, Equistum Ramusissimum DESF. A Euro Branched Horsetail, Equistum Serpoids MICHX. A Euro Dwarf Horsetail, Equistum Variegatum Schleichex Weber and Moore A Euro Variegated Horsetail, Unplaced to Subchness. Equistum Californicum GN Jones, Equistum Robustum A Brawn X Engine, Equistum Tracheodon WDJ Koch, A Euro Equistum Their Mal, Middle to Late Jurassic, Argentina. Equals named hybrids equals. Hybrids between species in subgenus Equistum, Equistum A, Bomanier CN Page, Equistum A, Dice CN Page, Equistum A, Fontcari Rotham. Equistum a, Literal car one quarter Luex a UPR. Equistum a, McAfee ICN page, Equistum a, Maldanum Rotham. Equistum a, Robert Sardines, Equistum a, Roth Maleri CN page, Equistum a, Wilmoshir CN page, hybrids between species in subgenus High Watch Arnett, Equistum a, Farisha Clute, Equistum a, Murray Newman, Equistum a, Nelson E. I. Schaffen. Equistum a, Schaffnery milder. Distribution, ecology and uses, the genus Equistum is near cosmopolitan, being absent only from Antarctica, though they are not known to be native to Australia, New Zealand or the islands of the Pacific. They are perennial plants either herbaceous and dying back in winter as most temperate species, or evergreen as most tropical species and the temperate species rough horsetail, branched horsetail, dwarf horsetail and variegated horsetail. They typically grow 0.2-1.5 m tall, though the giant horsetails are recorded to grow as high as 2.5 m, 5 m or 8 m, and allegedly even more. Many species in this genus prefer wet sandy soils, though some are semi-aquatic and others are adapted to wet clay soils. The stalks arise from rhizomes that are deep underground and almost impossible to dig out. The field horsetail can be a nuisance weed, readily regrowing from the rhizome after being pulled out. It is also unaffected by many herbicides designed to kill seed plants. However, as E. arvins prefers an acid soil, lime may be used to assist in eradication efforts to bring the soil pH to 7 or 8. Members of the genus have been declared noxious weeds in Australia and in the U.S. state of Oregon. All the Equistum are classed as unwanted organisms in New Zealand and are listed on the National Pest Plant Accord. If eaten over a long enough period of time, some species of horsetail can be poisonous to grazing animals, including horses. The toxicity appears to be due to thaminous enzymes, which can cause thiamine deficiency. People have regularly consumed horsetails. The young plants are eaten cooked or raw, but considerable care must be taken. For example, the fertile stems bearing strobili of some species are cooked and eaten like asparagus in Japan. The people of ancient Rome would eat meadow horsetail in a similar manner, and they also used it to make tea as well as a thickening powder. Native Americans in the Pacific Northwest eat the young shoots of this plant raw. The plants are used as a dye and give a soft green color. An extract is often used to provide silica for supplementation. Horsetail was often used by Indians to polish wooden tools. Equistum species are often used to analyze gold concentrations in an area due to their ability to take up the metal when it is in a solution. Medicinal uses, extracts and other preparations of E. Arvans have served as herbal remedies, with records dating to ancient Greek and Roman medical sources. Its reported uses include treatments to stop bleeding, treat tuberculosis, to heal wounds and ulcerations, and to treat kidney ailments. In modern times, it is typically used as an infusion. Reliable modern alternative medicine sources include cautions with regard to its use.
In 2009 the European Food Safety Authority issued a report assessing some specific health claims for ERV and C Euro for example, for invigoration, weight control, and skin, hair, and bone health the Euro concluding that none could be substantiated. There is insufficient evidence to draw conclusions regarding its effectiveness as a medicine for all human conditions described. Even so, e-gigantium preparations are widely used in South America as an orally administered diuretic to reduce swelling caused by excess fluid retention and for urinary infections, bladder and kidney disorders. Horsetail preparations contain silicon, so they are sometimes suggested as a treatment for osteoporosis. Some equisetum preparations are reported to have a high content of aminus, which may induce edema and cause lack of motor control, putting a person at risk of injury from falling. Bradycardia and cardiac chythmia are further negative side effects. Since horsetail contains nicotine, it is not recommended for young children. See also, List of plants poisonous to equines. References Further reading, Walko Wick, Radislaw IEA a Euro Equistum Taxonomy. Version of October 4, 2008. Retrieved November 7, 2011. Prior, K. M. Schwartz Peltz, E. Wolf, P. G. Schneider, H. Smith, A. R. and Cranfield, R. Phylogeny and Evolution of Ferns with a Focus on the Early Leptosporangiate Divergences. MJ Bot 91, 10. 1582-1598. PDF full text, Rotishorza, are polymerous leaf whorls in vascular plants, developmental morphology and fuzziness of organ identities. International Journal of Plant Sciences 160, S81 Euro S103 DOI, 10.1086-314221. PMID 10572024. Weber, Reinhardt, Equisitites i Equecoligenesis sp November, in Resen Scarchtelhamos der Spar Currency Triassician Formation Santa Clara, Sonora, Mexico, Equisitites i Equecoligenesis sp November, a tall horsetail from the late Triassic Santa Clara Formation, Sonora, Mexico. Review de Pala Copyright or Biology 24, 1, 331-364. German with English abstract. PDF full text. External links. Equistum at the Tree of Life Web Project, National Collection of Equistum, The Wonderful World of Equistum, International Equistological Association.